Hi guys and welcome to the 102 episode of Logo History. Today is about Azteca Uno, TV Azteca, dot R, Canal 7, Bali's Basics Classic Remastered, Jazzwares, Dominoes, Sega, Capcom, Fago, and Manamanihan Broadcasting Company. Dominoes is requested by M Videos U8P, Jazzwares is requested by Jack44456, Sega and Capcom is requested by Juan Hedgedog. Dot art and Canal 7 is requested by your local Argentinian user, TV Azteca and Azteca Uno is requested by your local Mexican user and Fago and Manamanihan Broadcasting Company is requested by Genki Rose 325. First, let's talk about Bali's Basics Classic Remastered. It is a free-to-play game developed by Basically, Games. It is a recreation of Bali's Basics Classic, Bali's Basics Birthday Bash as well as a demo of Baldi's Basics Plus. It uses the Baldi's Basics Plus engine and includes game mechanics from Baldi's Basics Plus, such as the Baldicator, a new stamina bar texture, and a new inventory design. 2022 to 2022, there is the word Baldi's in green text on the right of it. There is the word Basics in black text and below it there is the word Classic in red text and below it there is the word Remastered in 3D golden text. Now. Let's talk about Jazzwares. It is an American company headquartered in Plantation, Florida that designs and manufactures toys and other consumer products. As of 2022, the company is owned by investment holding company Berkshire Hathaway. The company is best known for its Squishmallows plush toy line. 1997 to 2010, there is the words Jazzwares Toys and incorporated in red text on a black, white, blue, and yellow outline. 2010 to 2020, there is a blue square and on it there is a white letter J and below it there is the word Jazzwares in blue text. 2020 to the present. There is a blue square and on it there is a light blue and white letter J and below it there is the word Jazzwares in light blue and blue text. Now, let's talk about .r. It is the Internet Country Code top level domain for Argentina. It is administered by Nick Argentina. Registering in our domain directly is allowed as of 2020 1987 to 2012, there is no logo for .r. 2012 to 2020. There is a blue shape and inside it there is the word dot R in white and yellow text. 2020 to the present, the circle is brighter. Now, let's talk about Manamanihan Broadcasting Company. It is a Japanese radio and television station. It founded in 1953 and headquartered in Kagoshima, Japan. 1953 to 1961, as Radio Manamanihan, there is the word MBC in black text. 1961 to 1981. As Manamanihan Broadcasting Company, the text is taller. 1981 to the present, there is a blue circle and inside it there is a bunch of white lines and on the right of it there is the word MBC in blue text and on the right of it there is a word in blue in Japanese. Now, let's talk about Capcom. It is a Japanese video game company. It has created a number of critically acclaimed and multi-million selling game franchises, with its most commercially successful being Resident Evil. Monster Hunter, Street Fighter, Mega Man, Devil May Cry, Dead Rising, Dragon's Dogma, Ace Attorney, and Marvel vs. Capcom. 1979-1983, as Erm Corporation, there is no logo for Erm Corporation. 1983-1989, as Capcom, there is a black rectangle and on it there is the word Capcom in black text. 1985-1994. There is a red rectangle and on it there is the word Capcom in white text. 1989 to the present, there is the word Capcom in yellow text on a blue outline. Now, let's talk about Sega. It is a Japanese multinational video game company and subsidiary of Sega Sammy Holdings headquartered in Shinagawa, Tokyo. It produces several multi-million selling game franchises for arcades and consoles, including Sonic the Hedgehog, Angry Birds. Fantasy Star, Puyo Puyo, Super Monkey Ball, Total War, Virtua Fighter, and Yakuza. From 1983 until 2001, Sega also developed its own consoles. 1946 to 1959, as service games, there is the word service and games in black text. 1956 to 1975, as Sega, 
there is the word saying in red text. 1975 to 1982, there is the word saying in blue text. 1982 to the present, the font has changed. Now, let's talk about TV Azteca. It is a Mexican multimedia conglomerate owned by Grupo Salinas. It is the second largest mass media company in Mexico after Televisa. 1992 to 1993, as Television Azteca, there are five black shapes and below it there is the words Television and Azteca in black text. 1993 to 1994, as TV Azteca, there is a green and black square and on the green part there are five black shapes and on the black part there is the words TV and Azteca in white text. 1994 to 1996. There are five colorful shapes and below it there is the words television and Azteca in black text. 1996 to 2011, the word television has been replaced with the word TV. 2011 to 2015, as Azteca, there are five colorful shapes and below it there is the word Azteca in gray text. 2015 to the present, as TV Azteca, now on the left of it there is the word TV in gray text. Now, let's talk about Domino's. It is an American multinational pizza restaurant chain founded in 1960 and led by CEO Russell Weiner. The corporation is Delaware domiciled and headquartered at the Domino's Farms Office Park in Ann Arbor Township, near Ann Arbor, Michigan. 1960 to 1965, as Dominic's Pizza there is the word Dominic's in black text and below it there is the word pizza in black text. 1965 to 1970, as Domino's Pizza. There is the word Domino's in red text and below it there is the word pizza in black text and on the right of it there is a red domino. 1970 to 1975, there is a red domino and on the right of it there is the words Domino's and pizza in blue text. 1975 to 1996, now on the right of it there is a blue square and on it there is the words Domino's and pizza in white text. 1996 to 2012. The logo is tilted and darker. 2012 to the present, there is a red and blue domino and on the right of it there is the words dominoes and blue text. Now, let's talk about Fago. It is a soft drink company headquartered in Detroit, Michigan. The beverages produced by the company, branded as Fago or Fago Pop, are distributed in the Midwestern, Mid-Atlantic, and Central Southern regions of the United States as well as southern and western Canada. 1907 to 1921, there is no logo for Fago. 1921 to 1930 something, there is no logo for Fago. 1930 something to 1940 something, there is the word Fago in black text and below it there is a black line and on it there is the word beverages in black text. 1940 something to 1954, there is the word Fago in black text. 1954 to 1962, there is a blue shield on the black outline and on it there is a white letter F and on the sides of it there are two black lines and below it there is a blue shape on a black outline and on it there is the word Fago in white text. 1962 to 1970, there is a red crown and below it there is a red shape on the white and black outline and on it there is the word Fago in white text and below it there is the word Zay in 1907 in white text. 1970 to 1988. There is the word Fago in black text. 1988 to 2001, there are five red knives and on the right of it there is the word Fago in red text. 2001 to the present, there is the word Fago in white text on a gray and black outline. Now, let's talk about Canal 7. It is a television station broadcasting from Las Heras, province of Mendoza, Argentina. It carries programs from America TV and Deltras and is owned by Grupo America. 1961 to 1965, there is a black oval shape and inside it there is a white drawing and on the right of it there is the words Canal 7 Menzoda LV89 and TV in white text. 1965 to 1979, there is a black number 5. 1979 to 1986. There is a purple green and blue number 7 on the white outline. 1986 to 1994, there is a blue rectangle and on it there are three blue lines and on the right of it there is a blue shape. 1994 to 1996, as Mendoza teeth, there are 10 purple and blue spheres. 1996 to 1997, as Canal 7 Mendoza teeth, now the sphere are tilted. 1997 to 1997. 
Now below it there is the words Canal 7 Mendoza and Tevin Black Text 1997 to 1998. There is a red circle and on it there is a golden number 7. 1998 to 1999. The number is brighter. 1999 to 2000. As Canal 7. The number is now gray. 2000 to 2008. As Canal 7. There is a red circle and on it there is a yellow number 7. 2008 to 2009. The circle is now gradient. 2009 to 2010, there is a red circle on a gray outline and on it there is a white number 7. 2010 to 2011, the circle is now in another perspective. 2011 to 2013, the circle is now in another perspective. 2013 to 2015, as El Siete, there is a red 3D shape and below it there is the words El and Siete in black text. 2015 to the present. There is a red shape on the gray outline and below it there is the words El and Siete in black text. Now, let's talk about Azteca Uno. It is a Mexican national broadcast television network owned by TV Azteca, with more than 100 transmitters across the country. Azteca Uno broadcasts on Virtual Channel 1. Azteca Uno programming is available in Mexico on satellite via Sky and Dish Network, as well as all Mexican cable systems and some Azteca you know programming were seen in the United States on Azteca America 1968 to 1969 as XHDF TV there is the word XHDF in black text and on the right of it there is a black oval shape and inside it there is a white number 13 1969 to 1974 there is a black shape and inside it there is a black shape and inside it there is a black number 13 1974 to 1985 there is a blue number 13 and on it there is the word canal in blue text and below it there is the word television in blue text. 1985 to 1990, there is the words red and nacional in black text and below it there is a purple number 13. 1990 to 1991, there is a green hexagon and below it there is the words I'm Evision La Red and nacional in gray text. 1991 to 1993. There is the word canal in green text and on the right of it there is a green red orange yellow dark orange and blue number 13. 1993 to 1993, as canal 13 to television Azteca, there are five purple gradient shapes and below it there is the words television Azteca XHDF TV canal and 13 in black text. 1993 to 1993, as Mitelli. There is a blue square and on it there is a white number 13 and below it there is the word me in yellow text and below it there is the word telly in black text. 1993 to 1994, there is a black square and inside it there is the word me in green yellow and blue text and below it there is a yellow rectangle and on it there is the word telly in black text and below it there is a black rectangle and on it there is the words canal and tris in white text. 1994 to 1997. As Canal Tres, there is the words Canal and Tres in black text and on the middle of it there is a red purple yellow green and blue number 13. 1997 to 1998, as TV 13, the words has been replaced with the word TV and as Azteca TV 13 two times. 1998 to 2007, as Azteca Tres, the words has been replaced with the word Azteca and Tres. 2007 to 2011. There is a blue circle and inside it there is a red yellow purple green and blue number 13 and below it there is the words Azteca and Tris in blue text. 2011 to 2014, there are five red yellow blue green and purple shapes and below it there is the words Azteca and Tris in gray text. 2014 to 2015, there is the word Tris in black text. 2015 to 2016. The word Tris is now in white text on a red outline and now above it there is the word Azteca in yellow text. 2016 to 2016, there are five red yellow blue green and purple shapes and on the right of it there is the words Azteca and Tris in gray text. 2016 to 2018, the word Tris is smaller. 2018 to 2020, as Azteca you know. The words has been replaced with the words Azteca and Uno in gray text. 2020 to 2023, there are five red, yellow, blue, green and purple shapes and on the right of it there is the word Uno in gray text. 2023 to the present, there is the word Azteca in gray text and below it there is the word Uno in white and red text. Ok guys this is it for today and stay tuned for the 103rd episode which I don't know which is gonna to be. Bye.